Today I'm very excited to share one of the best streaming LinkedIn integrations on the webinar market. Univid integration to LinkedIn Live. LinkedIn streaming is popular. We've heard from the LinkedIn community. It's very easy to get your audience in. Really getting that friction down to zero for your audience to tune into your webinar or stream. There is a need to be able to stream to your audience even if they are on the metro and they just tune in via phone. LinkedIn is a great channel. If you have, let's say, more than a thousand followers, you have a great potential to get bigger and broader reach if you also stream to LinkedIn. Also, depending on your webinar or stream format, some streams are better done on LinkedIn since you have a, a bigger channel on LinkedIn compared to your newsletter or maybe a customer pool. So this really cost with our end customer real innovation in our streaming. This is a great way to maintain one platform that you can still use in a very powerful interactive and more targeted webinar format, but to really leverage the know-how in your organization for LinkedIn streaming as well. The same interface, the same go live. Let's get started. First and foremost, you need to create a room in Univid where you can actually stream from. If you haven't gotten an account, you can always just go to our homepage and you can get started. We even have a automatically branding uh, functionality for you, so you can have a beautiful session in less than 60 seconds. However, if you have an account, you just press create session up here and you create room. Note that these times here are just for information purposes. You have full control when you are going live. This is a quite plain page, but let's brand it. Now we're good to go. Final touch, we're gonna add our beautiful logo. Nice. Now it's time to set up your uh, stream here. So we're gonna enter the studio, choose your camera and settings. Uh, and also you can set here studio quality if you want to get that crispy full HD. Just make sure that you are on a strong and stable internet. Press the menu and you can find the uh, advanced settings. So when you press here you can add a destination. Finding the LinkedIn stream page can be quite tricky. Easiest way to do it is just to go onto this link that I have written in here and I press enter. What happens then is that I directly get to the advanced create event mode where I can choose if I want to schedule this event for later uh, and I can even preview. Note that you are only able to, to edit these um, final streaming settings approximately one hour before you go live. I will now just say that I'm going to, to stream live directly so you can see the flow. In here you have stream settings. I choose the region where I want to stream from. Once you have done this you will get your streaming keys. I simply copy the first one onto Univid like this. The second I copy and I press create. Now we have successfully integrated our stream to LinkedIn and fear not, you can actually check that your stream is up and running before going live on LinkedIn, which is very neat. All you need to do is to press go live in Univid. There is a, a streaming delay when you're streaming to LinkedIn, so this might take uh, a couple of seconds before you will see your preview. It's a little bit of, you know, uh, fine tuning here, because in LinkedIn, you are not allowed to start the stream until you hit the exact minute mark. It would be good to be two people, of course, so you can pretty much sync these two. Note that you can uh, start the stream on LinkedIn and then press go live in Univid. But the best use case is of course that you press go live in Univid and then after you press go live on LinkedIn pretty much at the same time just to make sure that the first seconds of the stream looks coherent on both platforms if you're going to use both platforms. Press go live in Univid. Now the recording have started in Univid. So that's why it's beneficial to start the stream pretty close to when you're actually going live because then your recording will be much cleaner. We can already check the preview here once we published and now I'm actually behind. Here we go, on air, sending out on LinkedIn. Here we have a preview I can write and I actually have a few people checking in as well. That's very interesting. <laughs> I have no idea who is watching me at the moment. But remember that you can still use some of Univid's branding features in LinkedIn. Change the, the background we have here, uh, which will be seen in both in the recording and when you are live on LinkedIn. Leverage our splash in your recording and streaming. 
and I will use this in studio. Oh, and by the way, a quick tip. The most common uh, hiccup is that you forget to sound check the microphone device. Make sure that you hear, choose the microphone. You can see it by the, that the microphone volume is moving. 